now, if you've got some old furniture hanging around the house and uh, you don't really know what to do with it, well, guess what? Our next guest, well, we, I want to call her a grungy gal, and I mean that in the <laughs> nicest way. This Thanks. is, <laughs> I really do, this is Bridget Foster. I love the name of your company, thank Grungy you. Gals. Thanks. Thanks for having me. Yes, thank you for being here. And you know what? I just want to just take a little gander, if we can, at some of the items, big items that you brought in. And this is kind of your passion, Bridget. You like to find things and, and then turn them into something else. What, what was this? We picked this at a, a local um, resale place, and um, it was just an old grungy door, and I loved it because of the window. Oh my gosh, look at this okay. is so super cute. <laughs> it was a door. It you, was. You even left the handle on it. You know what? Or we put a new one we on put it. new ones on it. Yeah, we we rip off some of the old hardware and put new fresh stuff. And turned it into a hall tree. Yes, I did. love that. Some Thank of these you. items that you repurpose over here. Now, did you actually put all the stenciling on? I here? do. Yep, we paint. My husband paints it all, and then I kind of. You fancy add it up. You yeah. add to it. Add to it. I love it. All right. And then, and then over here, this was a uh, a headboard and a footboard. Yep. It's a exactly headboard, footboard, and then we use the rails even for the side pieces and make it into a, a, an entry bench. So I love it. Now Thank you, you kind of do the the junket. Junkets. Yep, we the junket do. Circuit. Yeah, definitely. And you were kind enough to bring along um, some ideas here today that that you can do at home. What what would this be, and what was it? Um, these are old vintage um, Jello molds that we picked up at like the garage sales or whatever. You can mm -hmm. find like at cupcake holders, anything. And then we just got a basic board, and then you just. Take them and screw them right onto there. Oh, they're permanent. Yep, they're permanent. Okay, so did you? You had to make the hole, obviously. Yep, make the okay. hole, and All right. then just drill this right in there, and then plop your little tea lights on there. Oh my and gosh! Then you have a cute little table arrangement. I'm just going to show everybody yeah. at home. Look how cute that is. They're all tea lights across the top or inside, and wouldn't that make an awesome yeah, centerpiece? I think so. <laughs> and you make you make these. These are adorable. Yeah, we have these in various boutiques around the valley, and um, the junkier the better. I just collect. <laughs> junk and I actually take apart old jewelry and we just kind of junkify the middle. Junkify! <laughs> I like it. Junkify! <laughs> and then, um, this is super thank cute. Thank you! And then sometimes I try to find vintage material and like this is off of a repurposed t-shirt. Okay, so you just got an old t-shirt over here yep. and you've kind of started the process and is this kind of the step-by-step -step yep, that you exactly. do? Exactly. Just thank you. Thanks yeah. for sharing this idea yeah, no by problem. the way. And then <laughs> and then you just add just like found items. Here look this is looks like it's from a, a game piece. Yep, it's an old vintage um, bingo piece. So how yeah. adorable is Thank that? Did you. you make the vintage sign as well? I did, yep. How clever. I Thank love you. how you took all these found pieces to actually create the letters. Little um, can openers and I don't even know what that is. An the old, old wine. wine opener, yeah. Oh my gosh, yeah. and the V, a nutcracker. How Thank adorable you. is that? Thank all right, well, we have all the information for yep. Bridget and she's a, she's a grungy gal I in am. a nice kind of way. <laughs> we love her. She has Thank all you. very clever stuff and, of course, you can find her Facebook page and find out where you're yep, going to be definitely next. next show. Okay, mm -hmm. oh, one coming up? Um, in April, there's one up for the junk in the trunk. Can't so. wait. Yeah, All of that information <laughs> on sonoranliving.com. Thank you.